And that breaking news we told you about at 5. A woman is dead, another driver injured after a crash near a Richmond Elementary School. I'm Bill Fitzgerald. I'm Candace Burns. In for Stephanie Roshan, our John Burkett is live on Grove Street to tell us what witnesses saw before the accident. John? Candace, the driver of that SUV behind me is at VCU Medical Center. Police say he has life-threatening injuries. A female driver of an Audi was just taken away by the coroner's office a few minutes ago. Now, take a look at some of the video we shot earlier. Here's what police say happened around 3 o'clock this afternoon. A man driving an SUV east on Grove Avenue at a high rate of speed, according to police, hits the driver of an Audi. She dies on scene. The SUV then jumps the median barrels through a fence in a front yard before coming to a stop by hitting a porch of a Grove Avenue home. One man who lives nearby says he heard a thunderous bang. You know, it's nothing that we ever thought would happen. Um, certainly if somebody's going at a high rate of speed, it's, it, it can be dangerous living on one of the main roads like this, but you, you never expect or can plan for anything like that. Bill and Candace, police say they will have Grove Avenue shut down between Woodlawn and Westmoreland Street for the next couple of hours, taking measurements. The crash team working out here. Coming up at 11, hear from the man that lives inside this home behind me and how close he says his wife and mom were to being involved in this tragic accident. Working for you in Richmond, John Burkett, CBS 6 News.